You're burning daylight, Clark. Some of us have things to do. Give me a moment. I have some footage I need you both to see. Is that from the state park? The client already canceled. The invoice has been collecting dust on your desk since last year. That's not what's important. Just watch the video. You're a sick freak, you know that? The hell is wrong with you? You wouldn't believe me if I had just told you about it. Whatever. Now that we're on the same page, I decided to do some of my own digging, since I'm already familiar with the park. Here's a list of all the wildlife that's native to the area. You know what they all have in common? No carnivores. Exactly. And, importantly, none of them are capable of mauling a wolf. Maybe it was a bear. Read some were found wandering in nearby. Or maybe another wolf. That's what I assumed at first, too. But from what I could find, everything below its ribcage was cleaved clean off. Too pretty a cut for any animal I know of. Okay, so a person did it played Frankenstein with a poor little puppy. There's something more to this. I can feel it. I plan on heading back into the park today and hopefully manage to get some better leads on this. Leads? Did a new client ask you about this or something? Well, no. But if half a wolf can just vanish, this might be the cause of some other disappearances. Sam, do you have time for this? Weren't you supposed to be working on an infidelity case? Come on, I can do so much more than just stalk an adulterer. You ever gonna do your job, Clark? You don't get paid to write novels. No one gives a damn about a dead dog. This is my job. I have something. I know it. And I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. Hey, on the bright side, more disappearances, more work. I should probably leave too. I think I left the stove on. All right, bye. Oh, by the way, honey, think you could grab some more cheese on your way home? There's still a little bit left, but better safe than sorry, don't you think? Sure, once I'm off work. Off work? I thought you'd be heading home by now. Did something happen? Yeah, something good, if you can believe it. Might get my hot street back. Really? On my life. This is the one. I just know it. Sam is back, baby. Yeah. Alright. But be careful, please. If you miss the counseling appointment again, Dr. Sean will be livid. I know. I know. But this one is the one. I feel this in my bones, Bree. And if it isn't? It will be. But... It will be. All right, I gotta get back to work. Wish me luck. I love you. Love you too. This thing working? I'm heading over to the park now. There's a guy I need to grill. This will be his second time caught on camera. Hey, uh, excuse me, do, do you work here? Yes, I do. Is there something you need, sir? Yeah, yeah, there is. Uh, you see, I'm here with my wife and my kid, and we found a dead wolf in the forest, and I, I just wanted to let you guys know so you could, um, deal with it. 
I'm sorry to hear that, sir. We'll make sure to take care of that. Could you tell me where to find it? Oh, uh, a little bit off the main trail. Well, sir, we'll make sure it's handled, but I have to remind you to stay on the main trails only. Everything else is natural habitat. Oh, my bad, my bad. You, you know how kids can be. <laughs> but uh, back to the topic at hand, the wolf, it, uh, it looked very badly hurt, so I was concerned that maybe something bigger, like, I, I don't know, a bear, wandered into the park? No need to be worried, sir. There hasn't been a bear sighting on state park territories any time recently, as far as I'm aware. And if there were, we'd have sent out a bulletin. When's the last time you checked? Excuse me? How do you know one didn't slip under your radar? Sir, this is- How do you know? As far as you're aware? What the hell does that mean? You're trying to tell me something completely decimated that wolf and I'm expected to believe nobody knows what happened? I apologize for my wording, sir. What I meant was- I don't care what you meant. There are families here. That could have been my kid. I want to speak to your boss. Sir, I'm sorry for the trouble we caused you and your family, but you really don't need to tell my boss. I've just about had it with you. Yeah, I'll be speaking with your boss about your disrespectful attitude towards me and my family. Dude, I just started working here. I I'm sorry, alright? Really. If my boss finds out I messed up again, I'm dead. You know what? Let's crack a deal. Tell me what I want to know, and I won't tell your boss. Yeah, okay, fine. The wolf you probably saw was near the big rocks, right? And how do you know that? Sometimes I take extra breaks for photography. It's my hobby. During my shift, I left my binder over there when I was doing a shoot because the rocks looked sick, and I totally forgot about it. By the time I remembered, it was wicked dark. No way I could have found it. And now I'm scared to hell that if I run for it now, my boss finds out. Tell you what, if you can give me that photo, I'll grab your binder for you. You serious? You're a lifesaver, dude, thank you. Don't mention it. I'll be right back. Didn't get much, but it seems I can cross animals off the suspect list. Rox looks sick. What does that mean? say this a lot, but, um, I'm sorry. Probably real tired of hearing that, huh? Well, uh, I'm on to something, Bree. You gotta believe me. Not that it's any excuse. I, uh, <laughs> I got the cheese, though. Gouda, mozzarella, and little pepper jack. I promise in the future it'll arrive in 30 minutes or less. <laughs> uh, Alright, I'm, uh, I'm heading back now. I gotta do some research when I get back. I love you.